What up, it's your girl's break gamer girl, and welcome to or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, my name is Spirit Gamer Girl, and I am the official dork of the internet and the internet's favorite dork. And for today's video, I am super duper excited. I may not look excited, but that's because I just woke up and I'm laying on my floor. A <laughs> fun little video today, unboxing these babies right here, the four versions of the newest album from the biggest boy band, on the planet currently by the name of BTS and they just came out with an album on February 21st called Map of the Soul 7 and so of course I had to get all four versions and actually the funny thing is I originally wasn't going to get all four versions I was just gonna get one and I actually pre-ordered one of them and it was a random selection but of course my impatient else as <laughs> decided to cancel that and instead go to target and get all four and the funny thing is it's actually three of them versions one two and four i actually originally wasn't even planning on getting at all because i went to target and i initially just got this one because this is the one they only had but then of course yesterday as of filming this video i went back to target on my way to work because why not and saw that they had restocked the shelves so of course i was like hey let me get the rest of the versions and go broke just kidding i'm not broke i'm just 80 dollars less because Thank you, Target. But nonetheless, I'm gonna stop yammering on. And that is why I'm at this really awkward angle, laying on the floor in my pajamas because I just woke up. I was too excited to open these and see what I got. And so I'm actually gonna put, this isn't really a disclaimer, but it is a disclaimer, I don't know. I'll stop my yammering. You don't have to see my face anymore and let's get on with this unboxing video. Yay, transition. I already know you're gonna see my lovely legs. So scandalous. Version one, version two, version three, the one that I had already unboxed, version four. The very first one that we're going to open is version one. I was actually super duper excited about these albums. I know people were saying how huge they were and I believe them. I, not for one second did I not think that they weren't huge or that people weren't joking about the size of these because literally buying these, I felt like I was buying like books out of a bookstore, not albums out of a well, Target. Tim Saran Wrap is killing me right now, but I have finally gotten the yeet. We got the three, which I will input these codes or whatever later. It's like, hey, if I just still get a chance to win to go to get sound check, that would be freaking great. And if I won, that'd be even greater. But nonetheless, I'm gonna stop yammering and actually get to the part where we unbox this. This camera angle is really weird. Like you don't even know what I had to do to get this angle, but sorry. Again, we're not gonna talk about this. Version one, Map for the Soul 7. I love this pink color already. I cannot wait. I've been trying to avoid watching unboxing videos of these albums because I know everyone gets different things for each of them, but like I just, so, of course, let me open. I have this CD over here. I actually really like these concept photos the most just because I like the contrasting white with the it's like dark grayish brownish pack. I'm not quite sure, but I, I like this the best. And so I like that they gave us giant posters. I don't know about previous albums because I only, the only other album that I bought, the physical album is their Map of Soul Persona. And it was just one album. Well, and actually I didn't buy this. Um, I got this for Christmas this past year. So I'm not quite sure about like previous albums in terms of like packaging and everything, but I definitely like that they give us like a poster and I believe each one of them is a different poster with different concepts. So, so this one one I haven't seen. Oh, okay. So for the photo card, I actually got a group photo, which it's kind of hard to see on camera a little bit because it might be a little bit dark, but I actually really like this. My only complaint is that it, it, it does seem a bit dark, but nonetheless, I'm not complaining too much because that's actually really cool. I didn't, I didn't even realize that they do group photo cards, but. And then here is the notes book, which I believe. Yeah, so all of it is in Korean, so I'm not gonna go through, but there's the notes book, of course, that it comes with. And then, of course, this. Not quite sure what this is supposed to be, if it's supposed to be like. Not sure if you're supposed to like write over here. I'm not quite sure. But yeah, it's the, you know, all their signatures. I am not sure what this means. Because I've, I've seen this. I'm not. I, I, I'm not. This one. Yeah, I'm not quite sure. But what, what that is. These stickers. Let me just say. Look at how cute these stickers are. These are so adorable. And I'm like, I'm dead with this middle one. <laughs> So cute. I'm not quite sure what this is for, but I mean, hey, it could be used as like a stencil maybe or just to color in. And then we have this. It has like 
lyrics for all the song like the names of the song titles and oh yes okay they want to be more eco-friendly and so that's why the photo books are like this instead of how maybe they were before let's get into the actual photo book okay hold on this is gonna be a bit awkward to do but i'm gonna do it this way so that you guys can see it and then i can kind of look over but it'll be upside down so these are oh yes i love these i love how they look like mini posters i'm not sure if they're meant to be posters i think they can be used as posters but obviously if you oh, wait a minute oh yes oh my god i didn't even see that i don't know if i skipped over it but they also have these in their photo books i think it's on the back of each page maybe oh yes okay so yes look at these ethereal goddesses i'm sorry but like what this is so yes Wait, please, is there a, hold on. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, okay, here's more. I was hoping that they'd have a group photo in the, like this pastel one. And it's, oh, no, sorry, it's falling apart. But like, these photos are still really good. And like, oh my God, they're so beautiful. They're such, yes, okay. So there's just like slight differences. And so it's it's still cool. And I like that they, that they always seem to do four different versions so that you can buy all four versions or just buy one. And that's totally cool too. Version two, I'm not quite sure. I feel like that a lot of this is going to end up being the same in terms of the like basic very basic content but that it's still very cool to see the different concept photos and have them like physically in your hand rather than just like seeing them on twitter very nice and i'm sorry if this doesn't show up very well these are pretty dark photos <gasps> wait a minute oh my god it is just a fun fact this, this photo is the photo i have currently as my background for my lock screen but it's like this obviously anyways moving on sorry i'm taking too much time getting sidetracked so the photo card that i got for this one is the one and only Jin. very nice very look at that i'm sorry look at that forehead look at that forehead even this forehead is perfect i'm sorry <clears throat> moving on so yes i got Jin notes as you've already seen since a lot of this is mainly the same thing i'm gonna kind of not really it's not really reacting a whole lot to it just because now that i've kind of seen like the basics of what's in each album i'm sorry this is i don't tend to usually do unboxing videos and this is kind of why because i don't really know what to talk about like even if it's something that like i'm reacting to to the very for the very first time i don't know i'm just kind of enjoying it a lot more There's, there's, there's a lot, and so I'm kind of just enjoying it. So here's the stickers again. Here's stickers is the last one. And of course the photo book. And I'm actually wondering, because I think part of it would be the fact that I feel like with each of these, like I've already seen the concept photos because I posted them on Twitter before the album was actually released, but it's, and I don't know, maybe there are some, oh yes. Maybe there are some photos, concept photos that maybe they haven't released yet, or that they only released with the, with the albums. I'm not 100% sure. Again, my only complaint with these is that they just seem a bit too dark that they could have like lightened the photo just a little bit just so that we can see a little bit more detail but besides from that there's not a whole lot it's still like these photos are still ethereal they're like basically my sleep paralysis demons is what these look like these would be like the one demons that i wouldn't mind if they killed me because like look how beautiful they are i don't have a whole i don't have as much room and i don't have all that shelving so I kind of have to find space for it and it doesn't really look that aesthetically pleasing but nonetheless I already have a bunch of stuff. On to version 3. So version 3 I already technically opened in a different video that I already did an unboxing of but what I wanted to, that's obviously not going to see the light of day. So we're just going to open it back up again and show you guys what I, what I got. I got this one. Which, this one I like a little bit better in terms of the lighting. I know I keep talking about lighting, but lighting is like a huge thing for pictures, especially if they're gonna be blown up like this. Um, you can still have like darkly lit photos, um, but just to make sure that they are also um, lit enough so that people can actually see what's in the photo or what's in the poster. So for this version, I got Taeyeon, this little cutie pie. And, oh, sorry, I'm not used to filming this, as I said. And so with each of these albums, I feel I feel like it would have been nice if that they did a little bit more variety, not just not just with like the concept photos and like the different coloring of like the sevens on each of the albums, but if they like for each of them, they gave just, you know, just a little bit more like diversity within within the content. I know something like for instance with like this book that has like all the lyrics and who produced it and yada yada and all that information. Obviously that should be in every version no matter what. And like the notes obviously as well that wouldn't change a whole lot. But like 
it'd be nice if they changed up like the stickers a little bit or I'm not, I'm not quite sure like 100% sure but they just feel like just little details that's just my personal preference anyways so this photo book was also pretty pretty dark i think well, i think all of them are pretty dark first floor i feel like might be a little lighter but i'm not quite sure i feel like i saw somewhere that it was that was like the one with like the more pastel concept photos but again i could be wrong and that could be they all could be having pretty dark one dark concept photos i'm sorry this, this is the one thing about this type of photo book that i don't like is how flimsy and floppy it is but yeah again my only complaint would be is that i wish these photos were a little bit more dark i mean yeah part of it is that maybe just on camera it doesn't show up very well but just also in person but again besides from that being the only complaint look at these meals i'm sorry how can you ignore that that's just how can you look this pretty in a photo <sighs> anyways last but not least version four let's begin shall we so oh i think that was kind of my own fault cd oh and immediately were greeted by the mr Young himself what a cutie oh look and boom two more cuties appear and wait for it all of a sudden we got seven cuties and oh my god i love this one jimin's my bias she didn't know that oh wait you probably wouldn't know that maybe you would know that i don't know well anyways there's more videos on why he's my favorite and i have a whole series coming on each individual member and why i like them and all that stuff based off of their and stuff like that. but we're not here to talk about that right now no we're not we're we're here to open up albums thank you very much this poster which i like the most again it's mainly because of the whole lighting issue because the rest of them are really darkly dark photos but yes and of course here we have i once again got the wonderful Jin and his worldwide forehead of course blessing our soul Anyways, so we have this as well. I appreciate that they are always making sure to give the content that they give us. It's always the most high quality content, which I can very much appreciate. And because these boys work very hard to put out content for their fans, as well as making sure to get every, take every opportunity they can to collaborate with new artists. And so very much appreciated the amount of work that they go in, that they take into creating these albums. We are finally on to the very last, what is this called? Photo book, sorry. Again, it's like 11 o'clock in the morning, which is not that early, but still. So here we go. This one I feel like was going to be my favorite. Okay, yeah, so it's not like pastelli, pastelli, but nonetheless, this is the cutest photo I've ever seen. Okay, I lie. That's not the cutest. It's one of the cutest because there's a lot of cute photos out there of them. But like, this is so freaking cute. Hold on. Oh my god, Arm is such a baby in this photo. He's the most baby out of all these and the rest of them just look like daddies. <clears throat> Sorry, what? Hello? What? I don't know. Well, and then there's this photo. This photo confuses me. Let me, let me, let me just be honest. This photo confuses me. If you're not sure why, don't ask because I'm not gonna explain. Most of them. Oh, okay, here we go. Kind of comic book style. I'm just gonna. Oh, they have a whole story to go along with it too. Nice, very nice. So with this one, I definitely. Oh, hello. Yes, please. Like boyfriend material or what? K drama boyfriend. Who? I like to BTS. And so, oh, hello. Why you're getting BTS? Yes. And that's 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 a concept I want to see more of. But like, yes. There's sugar, Mr. Meow 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 himself. Sorry. And then we got the rest. My bio. Uh, okay. Anyways, yeah. So I'm not gonna go through all these because it'll take a while. The video's already becoming like 30 minutes long. I'm going to. Ah, uh, no. This. This, hold on. This, 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 nope, this, 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 and this. So we have version four, version three, version two, and oh, hold on, version one. We're gonna just turn them around for your viewing pleasure. There we go. So these are the four albums one, two, three, four. I got a Jin photo card, Taehyung photo card, Jin photo card, and a group photo card. I know, I have a wide forehead. Let's, let's, we're not here to talk about i'd say my closing thoughts with these albums as well as the overall of the map of the soul seven album i love it and obviously that's no it probably comes as no surprise whatsoever because if i didn't love it i probably wouldn't buy one let alone all four versions but nonetheless there are even crazy people that will buy even more albums because they want to get all the photo cards or whatever reason or they just want to get a really good youtube video out of it and they can possibly make money off of it maybe not i don't know sorry where am i going with this right okay focus Overall, I really liked how they packaged these albums. I wish there was a little bit more variety in terms of not just like concept photos and photo cards and like the color of the sevens on the front, although I do appreciate that artwork and it's like, ha 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 ha, future video idea in the making, but nonetheless. I love the amount of time and effort that they put into making these albums, not only like music that's within the album, but the physical versions of them, whether there's one or four or 12 or however many. And this video was more of just another one of those fun things that I didn't want to just unbox them by myself i kind of wanted to film it and so that you got like genuine reactions from it and stuff like that.
like that besides from the version because I already unboxed it. But that's what that's like. If you did enjoy this video and you would like to see, well, you can't really see more unboxing videos because I don't plan on buying anymore. If you would like to see more K-pop related content, whether it's BTS content or other K-pop related thing, make sure to leave it in the description below as well as leave any other comments for suggestions for future video ideas. It doesn't have to be K-pop related. It can be um or it cannot who knows this video is dragging all right so if you did enjoy this content then make sure to click the subscribe button down below as well as click the little bell for notifications so you know whenever i upload which is once a week at least usually on sundays but sometimes I upload more than once a week so make sure you have the notifications on so you know that if i upload maybe an extra video or something as well as follow me on social medias especially on twitter because that's where i leave all my updates or give all my updates i will link all that in the description box below <laughs> the internet's favorite dork and the official dork of the internet is out bye see you in the next video world to end screen you want to see more content from me then make sure to click the subscribe button right here check out my other videos as well in the description as well as over here right now